Hi y'all, it's Beth here and today I am filming my what I melted this week. This is for the week of November maybe 6th? Nope, it's not even November 6th yet. This is for the week of I want to say like October 30th to November 5th and I did not do that good with melting this week because um, my family and I kind of got some unexpected news and it was not great news. Um, it was actually pretty awful news and I don't want to talk about it right now. But anyways, I just didn't get as much melting done as I, you know, usually do or would have hoped to. So with that being said, just don't have very high expectations of how many items I melted because I only melted like maybe six cents this week or something. Okay, so first off, I have Southbound Candle Co. Witch Please. The notes are crunchy caramel brittle, salted peanuts, toasted pumpkin seeds, and vanilla buttercream cupcakes. This scent is so amazing. Literally, I love it so much. Um, I know for sure that I'm going to have it in at least one more melting basket before the end of the year, so that is exciting, but that is a really great scent, and I'm going to finish it in January of next year, so yeah, I would definitely repurchase that one from Southbound. It is a great one. Um, another one from Southbound. This one is an empty. This is in the scent Apple Crunch Cookies. And the notes are crisp apple and warm cinnamon blends into a sweet cookie dough with crushed almond and vanilla cream. And this scent is good. It's like a medium light throw in my house. Um, I wouldn't repurchase it just because I didn't get the strongest throw from it. But it did throw and so, you know, that is good. But... I just really like, you know, to have powerhouse scents in my house. So that's why it wouldn't be a repurchase for me. Um, from Teddy Bees, I actually melted this one on Halloween. This one is Trickin' and Treatin' from Teddy Bees. The notes are blue sugar, which is pink and blue sugar, beach treats, which is beach nights, and vanilla cake pops. This scent is really good. It's not like... It's not like your typical fall scent at all, so it was great to like break up all the like bakery and apple and pumpkin and all of that. I definitely would repurchase this one as one to melt on Halloween for the name and also just like for something a little bit different from your typical fall scents. Um, from l 3 xy Wonders, I have two. This first one is a bedroom melt in To All A Good Night. The scent, the scent description is sweet lavender, sugar cookie dough, adipose, and buttermint. This one smells good, but I kind of feel like it's kind of sort of like light compared to the other L3 bedroom scents. Like for example, I have um, Up Past Midnight. That one is like a strong powerhouse scent in the two pack of bunts. So I don't know what is up with this one, but it just is not like a powerhouse scent. Um, like how I'm used to when it comes to L3. You guys can hear that my dog Ripley is eating right now. So you can just hear him crunching and munching on his dinner. Um, okay, L3 Waxy Wonders Sugared Lavender Twist Better Homes and Gardens type. Oh, now he's drinking. Okay, he's done now, I think. This scent is actually really, really good. Um, I'm looking forward to finishing this one up. And then Destination Wax is the last vendor that I have to talk about. This first one is in the scent Bonsai. And the scent notes for this is strong, fresh, green, soapy scent. Great for freshening up the bathroom. I love this one in the bathroom. That's exactly where I melted it. And it just smells so amazing. It's not like any other bathroom scent I ever have smelled before. That is why I love it so much. And I actually did repurchase um, that scent as well. I repurchased two of them. So, yeah, I'm crazy about that scent. 
And then last but not least, this one is a empty in the scent baked apples from Destination Wax. The notes are baked apples drizzled with brown sugar, butter, vanilla, and warm spices, sweeter than baked cinnamon apples. Yeah, this scent is really good. Um, I enjoy it and I would repurchase it like once in the fall, but I wouldn't go super crazy buying it for like every season or anything like that. But it is nice while it lasts. And there you have it. That is everything that I melted this week. I know it's not a whole lot compared to what y'all are used to, but anyways, Hopefully you still enjoyed hearing about them and hearing my thoughts about them. Um, thank you so much for watching. I will see y'all next time. As always, make sure you stay positive till then. Bye.